pulled from the water? An old pot. Mayhaps his lass wears pots for shoes, in case she can't find a privy. You were supposed to fish out my slipper. I'm at a dance now with one foot bed. Tis a wedding. I've got to wear slippers. Oh, look, dearie. I did. Take there. Muck must have sucked it deep in. We'll poke your paws in there. Rut for it. Rubbish game. What's all this, then? <gasps> They're playing slip in for a slipper. Never heard of it? Never. Us gentry folk have other diversions. What's the object? Maid tosses a shoe in the water. A man's got to dive in and fish it out. And once I retrieve it? Well, your maid'll be pleased as punch. Or it means you're a gallant bow. And awful handy. Is that all? No prize? Not even a kiss? That depends on the missing question. If she wants to give you a kiss, she will. But she ain't obliged. Oh my. Oh, there's more to come. Prime game. Shawnee, your slipper. I shall prove I dive to any depth for you. Observe, Shawnee. My eyes are glued. Seems to think this is Just when you think you know all the Plowfolk's customs, they surprise you with slippers. So, now the shock's faded. Yes? What do you want, Geralt? Damn mucky that pond, sank in up to my armpits. Uh, I see no amount of silt could keep you from my shoe. And all the other shoes over tossed in the lake. 
Always better to do a bit more and even gain naught by it than to do too little and face regret. Oh, that's quite the theory. One founded in practice. For instance, I can now approach the owner of any of these slippers and she will lift up her skirt and bend over to don it, of course. Ah, oh, so generous. And clever. Just figuring that out? Hmm, I believe I've earned a kiss. Well, find the owners of those shoes. One might agree. Don't be jealous, Shani. That was but a jest. I don't give a piffle about the others. Oh, well. Recognize this, Cinderella. My shoe? Mm hmm Now extend your supple leg and let me slide it in. That is, on. Uh, thank you.